here and I haven't uploaded a video for a month. I'm very sorry I had my exams coming. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to spice up your room for the holidays or for Christmas for example or for winter whatever you do. So without further ado let's begin with the video. So the first thing I would recommend you guys is to change your bed sheet or your bed cover and have a color scheme and my color scheme is going to be purple and blue and pink. So now I'm just going to be grabbing this tencel I think that's what it's called or pipe cleaner I have no idea and some tape and I'm going to be taping that on my headboard in this really cute design I would say. It will really just spice up your room and make it way more festive than before. Next, I'm going to be going to my nightstand and removing every single thing that I had there before. And I'm going to be putting a candle, a Christmas tree, some flowers and more candles. And I'm going to be changing my painting into this really cute reindeer one and I'm going to show you how to make one. You're going to be needing a canvas, a concrete paper in these colors, scissors, wrapping paper, glue, and also you're going to be needing a pencil or a pen. So first of all, I'm going to be grabbing my glue and going to be painting it all over my canvas. And once I'm done with that, I'm going to be grabbing my wrapping paper and sticking it on nicely and flatly. So I'm going to be using this ruler to just make sure it's all nice and flat. So once I was done with that, I cut it out all the excess one and I made it in this really weird wrapping shape and I'm just going to be tipping that along. So once I'm done with that, I'll get a really nice clean edge. Now I'm going to be grabbing this round cap and I'm going to be tracing that in my red concrete paper to make a nose and cutting it out. I'm going to be making a small circle or two small circles for the eyes using black and I'm going to be using this brown paper to make the horns of the reindeer in this really weird shape. You can totally copy what I'm doing here and just going to be doing the same thing and cutting it out. So once I got all the pieces together, I aligned them properly on my canvas and started gluing them one by one, starting from the nose, eyes, and horn. There you go, your wall art reindeer is complete. You could totally spice it up by adding more tinsel, so it will look cute. Now I'm going to be showing you guys how to make this really cute snowflake made out of sticks. You're only going to be needing some sticks and a hot glue gun. You will specifically need popsicle sticks. First off, I'm going to be grabbing my popsicle stick and sticking two together like so. Now I'm going to be making three of these and you're going to get something like that. First off, you want to make an X sign and glue them together. Now grab the other one and stick it in the middle. So you get this really cute star shape. Once you're done with that, grab two edges and glue two popsicle sticks like so, so you'll get a diamond or triangle shape. And glue them in between like so. Now repeat the whole process to the whole part of the snowflake. So you get this kind of star again. <laughs> To make the snowflake particles, you're going to be taking a popsicle stick and breaking it in half. And you're at least going to be needing 18 of these. Grab three of them and glue them together so it will form this kind of illuminati shape. With one more popsicle in the center. So once you got six of them, just glue it in every single point or edge of the snowflake. And voila, you're done. I'm gonna be using this wall tape to make sure it sticks properly in my door and it will look really cute and I love it. Mm. 
Now I'm going to be showing you guys how to make these stocking plushies. These are so good for gifts if you don't have any. So the things you're going to be needing are some felt, hot glue gun, some more felt, scissor, pen, and ribbon. And obviously you need some fiber to stock it up. First of all, I'm going to be grabbing my stencil or anything and I'm just going to be tracing it and cutting it down. Now I'm going to make one more and making sure there's a diameter of one inch. And I'm going to be cutting it off. And I'm going to be stipping it off like so. Now that you got that all over these socks, you're going to be grabbing the small one and just going to be gluing them together. And to glue them, all you need to do is fold these edges and glue it with your hot glue gun. So once you get it all nicely done, you're just going to be doing it in the bottom part and to do it just put some hot glue gun down, fold it and put it back and just going to be doing that all around the socks so you get this real nice clean edge and just put your cotton fiber whatever and just stock it up inside your stocking. To fasten it up, grab your hot glue gun and glue it around the sides. Now grab your other color felt that you want it in the top of your socks and grab your rectangle stencil and trace it twice so you get that long rectangular shape and make sure that it can be folded like so so it would wrap around your stocking and now just glue it on. And wrap it around like so. Now once you glued it out, do the same thing in the top like before. And seal it up. And now I'm going to be using this black lace and glue it around my socks to make it more cute and decorated. And I'm going to be grabbing this thin ribbon and gluing it around the sides so it would have like this outline. And now I'm just going to be grabbing the same ribbon and gluing it like so so it would have something to hang on and i'm gonna be using a paper clip so i won't burn my finger to hold it up now i'm gonna be grabbing the black white and pink uh, felt and i'm just gonna be cutting eyes with the black and uh, you making the light of the eyes using the white and making cheeks using the pink one and to make the cute kawaii eyes just Stick both the black and the white together so it will look like so and just glue it on your plushie. Once you're done with that, to make the mouth, you're just going to be grabbing some more felt and just going to be stretching it out like so and you just need a really thin piece of felt and just going to be rolling it out and grab your scissors to snip off the edges and curve it up and try to make it as small as you can so it will look really cute and tiny. And now just glue it on using your tweezers so you would, you won't burn your fingers. And ta-da! And now just glue on your cheeks. And there you go. It's done. It is really cute. You can totally give it up as a gift or just hang it around your room. And you can make it with different colors like so. I did this white and mint one. And yeah, I also made a big one. And I made it some really cute moustache that I love and it's totally cute when you put it in your bed and there you go so I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did make sure to give this video a big thumbs up comment down below what you want to watch next and subscribe to the channel because we're trying to reach a goal of 300 subscribers by this month if it's possible thank you guys so much for all of your support I love you guys so much see you next time bye bye <laughs>